Hi, welcome back to Genotopia. How often do we travel? And when we travel, how often do we wish we had packed something else? Well, this is my one of my luggages that I, I have. And uh, I, there's a few things that I keep packed regularly. I showed you a video once before of things that I keep packed in a little bag that has shampoo and conditioner and everything I always keep packed. But I'm going to show you today a few things that I take with me every time I travel that just makes life a little bit easier when you run into the unexpected. And uh, I'm going to show you what's in this bag that I keep packed all the time. That time, maybe a few things that you hadn't considered that you might want to keep packed in your luggage too. Now, I don't always keep this packed, but this is something that I always take with me when I go. And I always take a jacket with me. No matter where I go, no matter what time of the year it is, I always take a jacket because you never know uh, if you're going to the movies, if you're going out to dinner, or whatever. It may just be a little bit cool where you are, so you, a jacket is always a good thing. Even if you're in a vehicle with other people, they may have the AC cranked up uh, a little too cold, or if you're on an airplane, it may be a little bit uh, chilly. So a, a lightweight jacket is always a good thing to have. Now everything else I have is in this little makeup bag right here. Everything else that gives me the comforts of home is right here. So let me show you what I keep packed. And some of these things you're going to think, oh, that's a little strange. But this is what I have and this is what I like to keep. And it sometimes makes my life a little bit easier when, I, when I'm traveling. The first thing that I like to take with me when I'm traveling, and like I said, this goes with me everywhere I go. So this is it. It is a Little Vera Bradley crossbody pocketbook. So if I don't want to carry my large purse with me, I have this little lightweight crossbody purse. It's big enough to carry my cell phone, a small wallet or just some uh, ID and some uh, uh, cash, a lipstick, just the basics, and I'm off to go. I also have my diabetic test kit, plus I have a week's worth of medicine for me and my husband. That way, um, if we have, either one of us have forgotten our medicine, I already have this packed and um, it just makes it convenient. Now I go through this about every six months and every six months and change the medicine to make sure the medicine stays fresh. So the next thing that I like to keep packed is a pain relief balm. If you're doing a lot of walking um, or carrying a lot of bags, this can come in handy for your shoulders or your feet and legs. So this right here is something that I really like to keep. I also like to keep a lip balm, and if you'll notice, these things are not beauty items. These things are just odds and ends items. This is great if you're walking on the beach and you don't want to wear a greasy lipstick or whatever. This is just a great lip balm. You can use it. Your husband can use it. The kids can use it. Um, you know, if you don't want to share a share, you can rub it on your finger and use it. Also, if you're wearing shoes that might be a little irritant to the back of your heels, you can rub it on, the on your finger and rub it on the back of your heels. And if you get one with aloe, it's also good for cuts. So, the next thing I like to take with me is just a little tiny flashlight. You never know when you're going to be somewhere and the power runs out in a hotel room or something. In today's world, you just never know when you might need a little flashlight to get you just out of a hotel room or whatever. So, a little flashlight. Now, the next thing, this right here works really good with my crossbody purse. I can stick... Um, my ID in here. Now this is RFID, so I don't have to worry about uh, getting my ID stolen. But I put my ID right here, uh, some cash and cards in here, and it drops down into my purse. So um, it's just flat and convenient. This one, now, I have been stopped in security, and let me tell you why. It's because I will stick cash in here, and I've also put my driver's license in here. And clip this to my bra and stick it inside my bra. Uh, I have been stopped in security because of this. <laughs> but it's worth knowing that I have uh, also a key to our vehicle when we've been traveling. I have a key to my vehicle, my driver's license, and cash. Just in case my husband's wallet gets stolen or my purse gets stolen, we have emergency cash. So um, I really feel a little bit more secure knowing this. Yeah, I don't mind getting stopped in security knowing that I've got a little bit secure, uh, I've got this with me. And if you don't want to clip it into your bra, you can clip it onto your belt loop and stick it into your pants. So uh, this was just a little inexpensive wallet that I had, or a change purse I had found. So um, those are two things. The next thing I like is a pair of socks. If my feet aren't warm, I don't sleep well. And I don't care if it's winter or summer, 
I like a pair of socks. So I keep just a one pair of socks with me. A little sewing kit. These are very inexpensive at the dollar store, like Dollar Tree, they're a dollar. They have a little pair of just scissors that basically just gnaws thread, but it that gets the job done. It's got a thimble, it's got buttons, and you can also, I add black buttons to mine along with the white buttons. Uh, it's got a needle threader, it's got safety pins, but I always also keep some safety pins pinned inside here, as you can see, because, you know, for some reason, you always seem to need a safety pin. So, a little sewing kit. Cannot tell you how many times I have used that. Uh, the next thing that I like is just a little small uh, first aid kit. Now, this is nothing big and elaborate. It's not going to get you through any major thing, but it, it, nicks and cuts and little minor boo-boos, it's going to be okay. You know, it's going to do you good. And here, I also threw a, a few pain relief pills, which I change every six months when I change my other uh, medicine. I've got a different size of band-aids. I also have some antiseptic wipes. So, it's just a basic first aid kit, but this comes in handy and you can refill it as needed. And I got the, the got this originally at the dollar store. So it's just nice and compact. I also like to carry just a clip to where I can tie my hair back when I'm putting on my makeup. I can pull my hair up when it gets hot if I'm at, if we're out somewhere. So this is just a nice little thing just to have in here. It doesn't take up any room, just nice and neat. The last thing you're probably going to think is ridiculous, but I cannot tell you how many times I have used this. People with me have used this. My husband has used this. It is an extension cord. There seems to never be enough plug-ins in a hotel room or a cabin when you're going somewhere. So an extension cord to me is a necessity. Um, it's great if your uh, cord on your charger for your phone is short. It's uh, when you've got a bunch of girls are out together and you've got curling irons and flat irons and this and that. Um, you know, you've got uh, three extra plugs on here, so you can turn one plug in to, into three. Uh, it gives you extra room when you're having to move out of the bathroom or away from the mirror where everybody's brushing their teeth, where you can go over here and curl your hair or flatten your hair. So, to me, this extension cord is a great commodity. So, uh, all of these things fit just neatly into this little um, makeup pouch. As you can see, they all come out of here, they all fit back in here, and um, if I had to take them out of my luggage, or take them out of this, if my luggage was full, I could just tick, stick them down into my luggage, and uh, it doesn't weigh hardly anything. Probably the heaviest thing weighing is the extension cord, but to me, it's worth it if I'm you know, carrying on an airplane or whatever. But anyway, these are the things I like to take. It makes my, my life just a little bit easier when I'm traveling. And like I said, you can carry a crossbody purse of any, of any kind of your choice. I've got several. I've got a Liz Claiborne, and I've got a couple leather ones that I like, and uh, I've got a really nice coach one. But this one just rolls up nice and uh, compact and convenient, and I just carry this one with me. That way, um, it's just nice and small. fits into this, so everything fits in here, and uh, doesn't take up hardly any room in my luggage. So, um, that's just how I roll. If you like my videos, please click like. If you like my channel, please subscribe. Be sure to click the little bell so you get notified every time I upload a video. Share the love, not the hate. And a few necessities or a few things from home always makes life just a little bit easier when you're traveling. Anyway, these are my necessities. If you have a video like this, please link it down below so I can watch it because I like to see what you travel with. It makes your life just a little bit easier when you're on the road. And uh, you may have an idea that I hadn't thought about and that I may want to add to my little pouch because I still have just a little bit of room in here. But anyway, share the love, not the hate. An extra little travel bag, it's a great thing.